Hey guys, this is Hamza and today I'm going to explain you a star search technique of which is a topic of artificial intelligence. So guys, it is also a subtype of informed search in which we have some additional information, additional information, information. Yes. So guys, I told you what is informed search in my greedy best first search video, which I, in which we have some additional information, which is called estimated cost or estimated distance. ST made it cost yes estimated cost or estimated distance of a current node to the goal node remember this this is an important one to the current node to the goal node so guys what is a star search in a star search basically it uses write it with me write it with me it uses heuristic cost heuristic cost this is a very important point that's why i'm writing here is it cost hfn and cost of cost to reach cost to reach the node n the node n from from start yes from start node yes this is a very important point guys you should write it it uses heuristic cost and cost to reach the node and from the start node which is g of n i will uh, write this formula here is the a star search formula which is f of n is equals to you should remember this or write it care and uh, understand it carefully guys g of n plus h of n which what is g of n g of n is our cost to reach the node cost to reach the node cost to reach the node from a start node the node path cost or you can say path cost and what is h of n h of n basically is our heuristic cost or heuristic value of each node heuristic value node so guys we will uh, uh, calculate uh, or manipulate uh, this a star search with uh, with the help of this formula so this is very important so guys now we use remember this this is a very important point uh, which we will using in our uh, in our calculation technique we use only last remember this guys the very important point we use only last note or you can say reach note where we want to reach from one note to second note so uh, the second note is called last note so we use only last node or reach node heuristic value remember that guys in formula h of n will be only consider of last node or reach node okay guys in formula i will show you example uh, yes last node or reach node of heuristic value formula yes correct so yes suppose this is an example short example you can understand it carefully s to a i want to go s to a yes i want to go s to a so with the help of this formula the formula is f of n is equals to g of n plus h of n okay guys so what values should i consider i will not consider s a value of s which is 17 i will not consider i will consider the first the cost of the cost to reach node which is g of n cost to reach node uh, which is 6 cost to reach node is 6 between s to a okay guys and what is h of n h of n is heuristic value and i told you we only consider the last node or reach node heuristic value which is 10 as heuristic value is 10 so it becomes 16 so now go to the next page where we do calculation so let's align it uh, now it's visible yes now it's visible so we will start with s to a it's our path we will see what is the shortest path to reach the goal and our goal node and goal state is uh, g we will see and our starting node is s so we will see what is the shortest path between s to uh, s to g to reach from s to g so s to a is 6 uh, we will see the uh, cost to reach the node value and the heuristic value which is 16 then remember that guys where we want to reach we will only consider uh, these uh, heuristic value so s to a to e uh, so what is the value of s to a to e this is some uh, initial examples 
एस ए सिक्स एस टू ए सिक्स प्लस एस ए टू ई सिक्स प्लस ई इज अवर लास्ट नोट आई विल राइट इट लास्ट नोट और लास्ट नोट हिस्ट्रिक वैल्यू वी विल कंसिडर सो ई हिस्ट्रिक वैल्यू इज फोर सो गाइज रिमेंबर फोर इज नॉट अवर पाथ वैल्यू और एड्रेस वैल्यू पाथ वैल्यू सॉरी हाँ यस डिस्टेंस वैल्यू ई फोर इज अवर ह्यूरिस्टिक ईज ह्यूरिस्टिक वैल्यू रिमेंबर दिट गाइज सो सिक्स प्लस सिक्स ट्वेल्व एंड ट्वेल्व प्लस फोर इज सिक्सटीन नाउ मूव फॉरवर्ड एस टू ए टू ई टू एफ ई टू एफ सो एस टू ए इज सिक्स प्लस ए टू ई इज सिक्स प्लस ई टू एफ इज फोर प्लस रिमेंबर दट गाइज दिस फोर इज नॉट अ ई हिस्ट्रिक वैल्यू इट इज अ पाथ वैल्यू बिटवीन ई एंड एफ फोर सो एफ हिस्ट्रिक वैल्यू एफ इज अ लास्ट नोट सो एफ हिस्ट्रिक वैल्यू इज वन सो सिक्स प्लस सिक्स एंड फोर सिक्स प्लस सिक्स प्लस फोर प्लस वन इज सेवनटीन यस एस सो आई विल फर्दर ट्रावर्स एस टू ए टू ई टू एफ टू no 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 guys i uh, first traverse to b because b is also connected to e uh, just like f so i will traverse to b yes b so i will see what is the heuristic value 6 plus 6 plus uh 6 plus uh, b is heuristic value 17 so it will be uh 6 plus 6 12 and 12 plus 6 18 18 and 17 is becomes i suppose 35 yes i yes 35 it becomes 35 so guys it is a uh, some example uh, values i showed you now we will see the direct path to uh, from s to g because s our starting node and g is our goal node s to a to e to f and to g so 6 plus 6 plus 4 plus 2 plus g's heuristic value is 0 So I will write six plus six twelve twelve plus four sixteen sixteen plus two eighteen eighteen plus zero nothing but eighteen so it consider as eighteen so guys uh, now I will find another path we I will find all the paths where so uh, after that after finding all the paths uh, I will uh, check the which is the shortest path among these paths and uh, I will uh, take and consider. Uh, my answer uh, the shortest path among these paths so s to a to e to b to d to f yes this is a path d to f and g so now value is i will write in second line so 5 yes 6 plus yes yes 6 plus 6 plus 7 plus Plus seven plus two. Yes, six plus six, plus six, plus seven. Seven guys, remember B to D uh, between distance is seven, part distance. Cause to reach the node. So seven plus per uh, two. Seven plus six plus two zero is equal to thirty thirty three. Yes, guys, this is a thirty three. Uh, now uh, the second path. I will is consider is S two. Yes, S two A. Yes, S two B two E two. Ah, yes, S two B two E two F two G. Yes, this path I did not traverse. I will traverse all the. Ah, uh, I will traverse all the uh, path of uh, which are uh, directly connected to B. so i which are going with b which are going with b so s to b s to b to d f and g so b has two child nodes so i will traverse all the child nodes of b so b to, uh, 5 plus 6 plus uh, 4 plus 2 plus 0 yes Which will become eleven five plus six eleven eleven four fifteen fifteen six eighteen seventeen 
17 sorry yes uh, it will become 17 then 5 plus 7 plus 6 plus uh, 2 plus 0 so it will become 12 uh, 12 plus 6 18 18 plus 2 uh, 20 20 so guys uh, another path and the i think last uh, well, last one is s to c to d to f f to g f to g so last path uh, and after that i will uh, see what uh, what will be our shortest path and consider only this one so 10 plus 6 plus 6 plus 2 is 2 uh, plus 0 is equal to what will become 16 10 plus 16 16 plus 6 uh, 22 22 and 24 yeah it become 24 yes guys it become 24 so guys now i will check among those paths what is our shortest path from s to g from starting node s to goal node g so so i will not consider the upper paths because uh, they are not uh, the uh, confirmed path of s to g they are only the initial paths uh, between s to a and s to a to e so i will consider the path from s to g so s to g this is the first path its value 18 and this is our second path its value 33 this is our third path its value 17 20 and 24 so among these are yes this one is my shortest path which is called 17 so this is my answer guys yes this is our smallest and shortest path i achieved by this traversing so guys uh, here i completed my video thank you and please like and share my channel and my videos and subscribe my channel please uh, thank you so much